ओके दिस इज़ द मोस्ट स्टेबल कस्टमोम आई हैव एवर ट्राइड देर आर अलॉट ऑफ कस्टमोम्स अवेलेबल एंड आई ट्राइड अ लॉट ऑफ कस्टमोम सो फार ऑन माई एनी डिवाइस आई हैव अप्रॉक्सीमेटली फोर डिवाइस एंड ऑन ऑल ऑफ दोज डिवाइस ओनली दिस वन इज एक्चुअली द मोस्ट स्टेबल कस्टमोम वाई सो आई शेव माई एक्सपीरियंसिस एंड वाई यू शूड इंस्टॉल दिस रोम द नेम इज लीनी जोएस येस यू गैस इट राइट दिस इज लीनी जोएस एंड दिस इज एक्चुअली वन ऑफ द मोस्ट स्टेबल कस्टमोम्स फॉर ऑलमोस्ट एवरी डिवाइस आई मीन विच एवर डिवाइस इज supported for this lineage os custom home your 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 device must have the stable version and this room shall not give you any kind of bugs yes it's just my own personal opinion i tried this and from uh, from my personal experience i'm using this from past 10 days it's super good no bugs at all let's just take a quick look at some of the things which are so good in lineage os the first one is call recording yes call recording is not a big deal but for example if you're using a pixel based custom home you always has the google dialer but in lineage os you have this usb dialer which means you can record calls without any announcement like this call now has been recorded etc etc so this is quite useful another different thing a few compared with the normal android be android custom homes like in pixel custom homes you have the battery usage from the last 24 hours whereas in lineage os you will see the battery usage from the last full charge which is super useful in my opinion and some things are quite better if you compare it with the pixel based custom homes that is why i recommend you to use this one and for me this is just super good audio fix is actually one of the most underrated audio sound equalizers and for me i think so it's not a bad deal also to use this thing you don't need to install any sound modes ex- extra sound modes or root your device or etc like that something is quite good audio fix is kind of underrated sound mode i think so but yes it's good enough to use it on your device well it's about only sound enhancement things if you don't want to use this if you don't consider this thing simply ignore this we also have one more thing called charging sound this is a very useful thing by the way i tried this you can simply change the charging sound you can simply enable or disable you can enable the vibration and as yes, as i just mentioned it's only about users own preference it's about this one the charging sound is also a very useful thing in day to day usage i found this thing quite useful that is why i'm sharing with you one more thing which i found is in the lock screen you have the display music visualizer and whenever you play songs of course it's related to song you will see the music visualizer displayed on the lock screen and yes it's also about users preference users own choice media cover art is also quite good if you like this thing you can use these things if you don't want if you don't like these things you don't want to use this you can simply skip this thing ambient display is also there if your device has a support for this they will not give you any useless features as far as i know if your device supports these features you will get these features one more thing which we found here is in the screen log in the terms of privacy you will see we have the option called scramble layout which is a very useful thing if you use pin lock on your device on your lock screen then you will see the able uh, see the option to enable scramble layout which will scramble the pin layout whenever you unlock your device the numbers will be randomized and yes this looks quite good quite useful i think so but other than as other options are just kind of same this is also actually good in the terms of day to day usage one more thing which i found here is in display settings is about minimum refresh rate one thing let me tell you if your device does not have the refresh rate option you will not see this option but if your device has uh, the refresh rate option like 60 90 120 you'll see the best thing is i found here is 90 hertz is enabled in my device by default my device does not support that i tried using 90 hertz and i did not found any kind of issues so this is super good and alongside that all the features that sectal you were looking for like basic features are already present so no issues in these things too what other than else if i move on to the settings option here you can see it does not give you any kind of game space so if you are one of the users who who are willing to install this custom in ba- in basis of gaming you can simply ignore this thing it's not for gaming it's good enough for daily usage and it's not bad for gaming but yes it's not properly optimized yet if i move on to the other options what we want styles i'll not show you just because in my case this is not the default launcher this is actually not the default launcher but we found if i move on to the other option i'm not using actually the default launcher i'm using sushi launcher by rooting my device but it's just my own preference in status bar we have some bit of options bit of custom 
customizations which are quite useful by the way like battery brightness status bar icons etc yes these options are already present and we these were expected too we have some quick pull down option available too which is quite useful for some of the users not for everyone but yes it is i'm not using these features anymore in gestures what i found here is you don't have the swipe to screenshot a little bit of disappointment for me to be honest i was looking for that option but unfortunately it's not there but it's okay you you can use any other part partial options if you want to you have the option available for that what other things i found here is the ota updates this is actually super useful this room supports OTA update so if you have their own custom recovery installed their own recovery like lineage OS always has their own recoveries if you install that recovery you will see you will see the OTA update and you can OTA update your device and for me I think so this room only this room has best OTA support there are many other custom rooms available which includes good OTA support but lineage OS is actually just awesome these are just my personal preferences personal opinions about this one one more thing which i found here is the stability as i just mentioned but the thing is what i found here is the thing about banking apps yes you heard it right banking apps is an issue if you want to use this thing it's quite stable but uh, if you were looking for a, to if you're looking to run banking apps on a device you need to root your device first pass the safety and status and then you'll be able to also not every app will support that thing i mean if you install magisk on a device if your device is rooted and even if you hide the magisk in settings some apps for example i found my geo those will still detect magisk or root on your device so yes this is quite disappointing so yes only a big disadvantage i found here but if you are one of the users who don't want to root your device i mean if you just don't want to install google pay services or if you just don't want to use banking apps you can use this thing or uh, like me i rooted my device pass the safety status i'm using only two and three banking apps and done also this room supports good theming options so if you are one of the users who love to do customizations on a device you can install this room you can root your device install avsp modes project themer repainter and you can even use the work profile like i am using here island is a very perfect choice for you like this you can do a lot of things it's just my own preference and my preferences my opinions i've already shared with you in this video I, find, I found this room as one of the most stable custom rooms and I'm considering it to be. If you want to install this thing, link is already available for the official website. I hope you like this video. If you like this, don't forget to like and share this. Goodbye.